Yeah, I haven't done this in a while. Back on this news. It's, you know, they do this on the news every day now, man. Every day they make the news like a goddamn talk show, like the real. Just to expose how everything is fake. You know, why would they make the news like a damn TV show? And you see they sit here and talk about all these feminist topics. They sit there and you see there's no dudes that sit there while they talk. And sometimes they invite a dude real quick from um like a radio station or something but them dudes don't be saying the truth you know what i'm saying and you just heard them talking about women's improv all that like come on man we all know that women are not that damn funny you got some out here that's kind of funny but overall no what the hell man i damn that thought she was naked for a second i was gonna say what the hell who is that she look like Mel b but anyways what is this hat i don't know i just cut it down Cause I'm trying to find the uh, the talk, uh, especially that one with um, who was it? It was Amber Rose getting naked. I, I wanted to show y'all to talk about that because they was talking about how she was getting empowered, talking about some is getting naked, empowering. I'm like, look how dumb they got these hoes. They got them so so slow. Let me cut this up. See what they talking about. If, if you just wash it with soap and water. They gonna come to a song. They do this every morning. I swear, every morning they they do some feminist crap on this on on this news. I'll, I'll damn near call it a show, but it's it's the news. I mean, what is it supposed to do? Is it supposed to stick on or something? Oh, Lord. Damn, is y'all talking about anything? Uh, we do have some top stories to run down this morning, including an update uh, to some breaking news. This is a serious story we were telling you about all day yesterday. I'm going to have to pause this and, and come back. probably talking about it as well because it was so crazy. Police say they have located Yeah, the fuck this shit. I'll be back. Alone. All right, I'm back. They was talking about a big, huge floating water park. I'm trying to catch them when they ta start talking about the stuff. Because they, they going to do it. You know what I'm saying? They do this every day. They talk about some feminist, sexist shit. And then they ask the stupidest questions. That's how you know the community, the country is so damn dumb now. Like, they're so dumb down. Like, I'm not even talking mess. I'm just being honest. Because it's sad how they ask questions that, to me, in my honest opinion, is common sense you know what i'm saying oh, now we finna see my weather out here in chicago wow ah, come on man yeah, it's hot out here y'all it's hot my bad i know y'all like hold on where is the i know y'all like where is the damn women talk right well it, it hasn't coming up yet they was just talking about it man with that amber rose because I, I found that to be so stupid because they really got women out here getting naked now and getting famous. You know, it's already bad enough that women don't do crap. And now you just want them just getting naked and getting money. You know, it, it don't work like that for us men. We can't come out here and get asshole naked. And then all of a sudden we got all everybody on us and stuff. You see, they promote women to be nothing. I swear, man. This is what they. Oh, okay, finally. Let's see what they say. Just ended. Her spotlight got even brighter. And she's been labeled a lot of things. Uh, Amber Rose is so ugly to me, too, man. I would never date a chick with short hair. Does, her short hair might make her seem feminist. She has short hair. Now they talking about her being a feminist. Look at this shit. I don't give a fuck what her body look like. I'm not talking to no girl that look like that with that head. Did you hear this? Uplift and, and sexually empower women. Including from Piers Morgan, who says, when it comes to feminism, she's doing it wrong. Whoa. Bring in WGCI's Kendra G in on the show. Hell Welcome yeah, what the hell is wrong with you? You That's shouldn't even be getting naked. Yes or no? Is showing yourself nude on the internet a feminist move? Is it is it ever good to do? Smart hell people. no. Listen, you I see how they ask common sense photo. questions. When I saw, first saw the photo, we, met, we had the edited photo up there, but she had, when I saw I was like, is that a new fur bikini in, in black? That would be good in like orange and <laughs> different colors. And the more I looked at it, I was like, oh, that's not a fur bikini. <laughs> oh, okay. I see what she's talking about. I was like, what is she talking about? Too much for Instagram. No, I think you, I think there's a way to be classy, sexy, maybe, but that's right. What she did was she 
because women need to learn how to be classy, sexy. You see, ain't no, you see, women don't do that no more. You see, back in the day, women could look good without having to show all their body. And now, since women are so desperate for attention, now they're starting to just be like, okay, well, I'll show you my bodies and you'll pay attention to me now, you know, because that's all what they really rely on. I don't think this is a part of the feminist movement at all. It's not, right? It's not, huh? But uh, you know damn well if a dude did that. Even though dudes are starting to do this, too. But not as extreme as women, though. Women are taking this to the extreme. Taking selfies, Snapchatting, whatever they're doing. And I just, well, so many times we have preached on here, both men and women, careful what you're putting out there. You can't put stuff like this. She's calling it feminine. She might as well say it to the women because they be the ones doing all the dumb, stupid shit. And teaching their kids to do it, not and they don't even do shit. These women let their kids do whatever they want. That's stupid. No, did you just hear that? Wow, did you just hear her? Did you just hear her just blatantly talk for us men and blatantly say, "Oh, we all were like that." No, the fuck we won't. You know, we want some real shit. We want a woman to fucking be fucking classy, like they said. Like they said, uh, uh, a lady in the streets, a freak in the sheets. We don't want no whores, okay? We got enough of them already. So don't be sitting there trying to talk for us, talking about, oh, we'll just love that. You know, you see how they make us men just seem like all we care about is sex. It's basically, that's why she said that. You know, it's like basically saying men don't have no standards, you know? This is disgusting. This is disgusting. Who cares? People should look down at her for this crap. Any any body looking up for her for this is that's something else they doing with the women now. You notice how they ain't they starting to be less and less talented. All right, now this is just some old bull crap. I ain't even go going to the the aspects of this to break this all down because best believe it's just some bull crap to make a certain group of people look bad. But anyways, yeah, I noticed that too. I noticed that a lot of these female stars they just not doing as much as what they used to. You know, back in the day, it's like you had to sing, you had to act, you know, you had to do something with some type of talent. Now, as you can see, oh, just get naked. Oh, just get on Instagram. Oh, just do that. You know. The, it's like we they putting on girls now that don't do anything, you know, but stuff like that. Like Amber Rose, like what has she really done? She don't sing. She's not a good actor. Why are we even paying attention to her? You know what I'm saying? Then she can come out and do stupid stuff like that. And then they come on the news and just show it to you as if it's something to look at. When in reality, it's not. And they're going to say, I mean, it just really pissed me off when it was like, oh, so if a uh, men men would just blatantly say yeah go ahead and do it this is feminism go ahead and do it i'm like oh my god you see how they just blatantly talk about the crap on the news but they never fully explain what it is and what's going on because they want to keep people confused because they know these topics are coming up so they want to try to distract and mislead people before they get a chance to understand what feminism really is about and female empowerment is really about because you see they don't know shit about that all they know is the advantages and the privileges and they just run with it besides that they don't know crap but i guess that was it i guess i just had to show you all that real quick because just show you how far it's getting man it's, it's getting pretty far with the stupid stuff that they do they do a lot of stupid crap